Hi, happy Monday, Shiva here. Happy to come back to you again with another Monday motivation. Let me begin today revealing you a fact. The fact is that God himself goes into isolation for 14 days. When? Every year. And since how long? He has been going into isolation for thousands of years, every year for 14 days. You must listen to today's Monday motivation in order to understand, appreciate and take the benefit of the isolation period that you are presently going through. You might be knowing on the eastern coast of India, in the state of Varissa, there is a town called Puri. And Puri is one of the four most sacred places on the planet Earth for the Hindus. Like, it's one of those Char Dham, you know. So it's a very sacred place. Why it is so? It is a sacred place because God has decided to reside in this place. And a temple was built for him. And that is the Puri Jagannath Mandir. The Mandir in which Lord Jagannath resides. Jagannath, Jagatkarna, the Lord of the Universe, resides in this temple. And along with him, his brother Balarama and sister Subhadra also reside in the same temple, same sanctum, sanctorum, same Garbhagraha. Yes, in this temple, the Jagannath Mandir, a number of rituals are practiced as per the system established and followed over thousands of years religiously without any deviation. And these rituals include uh, daily offerings, uh, some special offerings, periodical rituals and a number of celebrations that you would find very difficult to come across in any other temple anywhere. One of the most important festivals celebrated in this temple is Snana Yatra, the Deva Snana, which includes the ritual bathing of Sri Jagannath. It is performed every year on the last day of Jaista Masa, on the full moon day, the Purnima day. On this day, the deities are brought outside the Garbhagraha and bathed with 108 parts of water by people, by people whose faces are completely covered except their eyes. Why? In order to avoid any kind of contamination of this water with the sneezing or coughing of these people. It is a grand celebration. It's a grand celebration, a beautiful celebration. The decorations are beautiful. The musical instruments are played and the music around is very exciting and enthralling. The air is filled with joy and fragrance. And the mood of the people is something that you must witness to believe it. They're all eager to have a glimpse of God and have his blessings. After this Devasnana, the divine bath, the deities return inside the temple. But you know, despite the care taken at the time of bathing, it is believed that God becomes ill and he goes into self-isolation for 14 days. So the Garbhagraha is closed on the same day that he takes his bath and comes into the temple. During this 14 day period, no one is allowed to go into the Garbhagraha except for a few special people who go into the Garbhagraha to offer the bhog, the food, and also pan means the medicine which is offered to the God during this period. And you know that medicine? That medicine is made up of some special herbs collected from the forest and mixed with uh, curds, tender coconut water, 
and uh, a number of spices including um, nutmeg, uh, the camphor and uh, chandanam and other things. You know, and after this 14 day period of isolation and taking complete rest, the god recovers and the doors are open again for the public to have a darshan on the day of Chaturdasi in the Ashada Masa. That is Ashada Masa, Krishna Paksha, Chaturdasi, the doors of Garbhagraha are open to the public to have a glimpse of the God, to have his darshan, darshan of Lord Jagannatha. Do you know what does God do and what happens after this isolation period of 14 days when no one was allowed to see him? God himself comes out. God again comes out of the temple for a grand celebration of what is called Radha Yatra, the Chariot Festival, in which more than a million people, thus lakhs a Jadalog, they participate in this uh, Radha Yatra. They come from all parts of Varisa and all of the world to come and participate, sing, to dance, and to pull the chariots from the Jagannath Mandir to Gundicha Mandir. So it's a grand celebration. I hope now you understand why the God goes into its isolation and at the end of the isolation, what kind of celebration is that? Let me sing a prayer. A prayer for you, for me, and for everyone out there. Um, um, Shantakaram Bhujaga Shayanam Padmanabham Suresham Vishwadharam Gagana Sadrusham Meghavaranam Shubhangam Lakshmi Kantam Kamala Nayanam Yogi Rudyanagam Yam Vande Vishnum Bhava Bhayaharam Sarva Lokai Kanatham Vande Vishnu Bhava Bhayaharam Sarva Lokai Kanatham Jai Jagannatha, Jai Jai Jagannatha, Jagannatha Swami, Nayana Padhagami, Bhavatume, Jai Jagannatha. Let us hope with the blessings of the Lord Jagannatha at the end of this lockdown period, we also will get, you know, an opportunity to go out to come together, to work together, and to celebrate our life in style with increased energy and enthusiasm and cheer and happiness. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. See you again next Monday with another motivation. In the meantime, take good care of yourself and your family. You are awesome.